people just how good is this election cycle going to be? It's so good that the Democrats are actually going to lose New York State. That's right. Not only are they going to lose the governorship, they are going to lose what were considered safe congressional seats. This is mind-numbing. I'm going to share a video uh, from her getting hammered on MSNBC and then also show you some differences in rallies. And I know rallies don't say everything, but I'm telling you what, they, they are totally caught flat-footed on this. Never expected it. This is nuts. Hey, please check out MyPillow.com. Promo code Lumberjack will save you up to 66%. Let's get into this. So pulling from the New York Post and the Gateway Pundit, out of the New York Post, it says, tiny turnoff for Hochul New York City campaign event in stark contrast to Zeldin Throng. For Governor Kathy Hochul, three really is a crowd. That's right. A tiny group of supporters turned out lower Manhattan on Friday afternoon for a Hochul campaign appearance as momentum is swinging, I mean, in epic fashion in Zeldin's favor. So check this out. So here we have the crowd at Hochul's event. And then what happened was she showed up late and it got moved inside. And now she only has some media folks. She ended up getting there about a half hour late. In contrast, here's the crowd for Lee Zeldin. And pulling out of a report from the Gateway Pundit, he had fun mocking uh, the crowds. And I see said, uh, you know, with a thousand people there, he said, while we're here, Kathy Hochul is rallying with Hillary Clinton and Kamala Harris and the entire crowd would probably fit like over there, he said, pointing to a tiny section. That's how bad it is. They're pulling out their heavy hitters, spending their last days in New York, a reliably blue state. Uh, they're, they're, they're totally caught flat-footed, but make it even crazier. Check out this lady on MSNBC, take Hochul to the mat. But I'm going to interrupt you then. Here's the problem. We don't feel safe. You might be working closely with Mayor Adams. You may have spent a whole lot of money, but I walk into my pharmacy and everything is on lockdown because of shoplifters. I'm not going in the subway. People don't feel safe in this town. So you may have done these things, but right now we're not feeling good. We're worried we could be San Francisco. So apparently the mainstream media is trying to gain some credibility again by actually asking tough questions. Or is it that they see the handwriting on the wall and they already know that Hochul lost? I would love to see some internal polling out of, of New York. I did see the last Trafalgar poll and Hochul is losing. But people, if you're in New York, you have got to register every friend, neighbor, and relative and get them to vote a straight rack ticket. I'm telling you, the, the, uh, this, is, this is one of those elections where the future of the Republic truly is on the line. So smash that like as you would on your way out and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Peace out.